good Friday morning. We are out here at the Rivers Farm with their sheep and their goats and their alpacas and chickens and all the other critters. Talking about Jesus the Good Shepherd and, and looking at our text and our sermon for Sunday morning. I think the major connection I've had with having sheep in my relationship with God is the personal connection that comes along with each and every animal. Knowing every sheep by name, knowing what they're like, despite there being so many of them. Do I have to know them by name? Of course not. Do I have to have a personal connection with my sheep? Of course not. Do I? Yes. A good shepherd knows their sheep well. Jesus knows each and every one of us and has a personal connection with each and every one of us, despite not having to. He does not deflect us. He cares for us in ways we cannot care for ourselves. He does not leave us behind. If a baby lamb is abandoned by his mother or her mother, there are two options. You can leave it out in the cold and let natural selection happen, or you can pick it up and take it inside your home. You wake up every three hours and feed it, make sure it's constantly warm, and nurse it back to health. It is hard labor, and sometimes you do not get the result you want no matter how much effort you put into it. It's heartbreaking and one of the worst feelings in the world. It makes me realize how much effort God puts into us. If I was the lamb abandoned by the rest, left without guidance, straight from the path, he would come to me and take care of me. He would defend me from the cold, take me into his arms, and make sure I was healthy. And if I fall back into the wrong path, he is not disappointed. He will still come to me every time I have fallen and take me back in over and over, no matter how many times I disappoint. I invite you to join us at 10 o'clock uh, on Facebook, on YouTube, on our, on our website, uh, and, and hear what being a, a caretaker for sheep has to do with the way that Jesus loves and cares for all of us. Yeah, goats can sometimes be stubborn, and so can we. Hello. We'll see you Sunday. Hello, <laughs> 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 <laughs>